Hey guys, welcome to my channel. If you are new, please don't forget to subscribe, like this video if you enjoy. And uh, for today's video, we're actually going to be doing the, what are we in? August, <laughs> the August um, BoxyCharm unboxings. I have the base box and I also already received my premium box. So we're going to uh, just dive into both of those. As you can see, my eyebrows are already done. We haven't got any new brow products, which is okay. Um, I'm still using the KVD um, brow pomade and absolutely loving it. Um, packing on a little bit of that powder as always. And oops um setting them so you don't have that shiny cast um i am loving it but yeah let's go ahead and just jump into this video because it's a lot of good stuff and it's gonna be a long one so this morning i made a um smoothie it was really good it has um strawberry strawberry banana blueberries kale I put my collagen powder in there and I used cashew milk instead of almond milk only because my almond milk was closed and the cashew was open so it made it like a little bit more creamy but that's good tastes good so um okay so I love Tula products. They work really good. I love one of their um, superfood uh, acne facial cleansers, whatever it's called. I have it in my bathroom right now. And um, I love it. I think it works really, really good. It helps clear up the skin, any um, surface bumps, any under the skin bumps, uh, redness, all that stuff. It helps and it works really good. Now, um, in my last video, I talked about... Not the last, last one, but I think my last unboxing. I talked about um, BoxyCharm sending me a box and it only had two products instead of the eight. So this was one of the products that it did come with and I finally got the rest of the stuff and they actually sent me a double of this um, Tula Skincare Glow and Get It Cooling and Brightening Eye Balm. Uh, so it is the Probiotics and Superfoods. Um, so I have two of these now, and I wanted to use it yesterday, yesterday or the day before, and uh, see how it worked, and you know if I liked it and stuff. So I went to use it, and this stick, I kid you not, smells like bo. It's it smells so so bad, and. I feel like bad and I feel like horrible for having to like for saying it and stuff but it smells so so bad like and then I put it on my face I was like okay maybe it's just the stick and like if I put it on it's not gonna be bad or anything like that no not the not the case I put it on my eyes and I rubbed it in and everything and I can still smell it and it was so so disgusting but I just wanted to let you guys know um it did like glow and um, it leaves like a blue glowy look I don't know it was weird but and I don't want to put it on my hand but I'm just letting you know it smells really 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 bad let's uh, start with the base box cute cute I did have to take a little sneak peek because we needed other stuff so Let's just start off with, um, in my Catrice video, I said that I was going to receive one of these and I purchased another one in a lighter shade, but this is way better. So, this is the Too Faced Born This Way Super Coverage Concealer. It retails for $29 and I got this one in the shade Warm Beige. So, the other one is in the shade Short Bread. And I used shortbread in my Catrice video, and it was super, super light. So, this is Warm Beige. It has coconut water that aids a um, delicately replenishing skin's moisture level. And 
Alpine Rose helps empower skin's health and resilience. Um, and hyaluronic acid gives a smoother, more youthful appearance. So it hydrates, long wearing, photo friendly. Hmm, super coverage. Okay. So I'm going to show you both shades. This is warm beige and shortbread. Like, I cannot believe I picked this color. Actually, I can't believe it because I fucked up a lot and I always get lighter shades. So, warm beige and shortbread. Can you fucking see that? So, shortbread, I probably, probably, look at how light the difference is. Okay, I will probably use shortbread as just like an eye base or um, something like that just to, something in my eye. Uh, Clarence Velvet Lip Perfector in the shade Velvet Nude, number one. This is a velvety matte color. It holds, blurs, effects, and smooths lips. Ultra light, creamy texture, and extreme comfort. Um, cares for your skin, plant and rich, and lip hydration. This retails for $26. Oh, this is the little card. Retails for $26. Let's see. Best selling neutral lip perfector goes go bold with a new matte finish. A liquid lipstick with a lightweight smooth texture that delivers a highly pigmented velvety finish with soft blur effect formulated with conditioning and nourishing shea butter leaving lips feeling hydrated for hours. Ooh. Oh shit. That's weird. I thought it was like a... Do I squeeze it? Ah! Ooh. This is pretty... Super, super nude. Ooh. Hmm. Maybe we should... Oh yeah. Super like velvet, um, moussey feeling. Like the um, nude sticks kind of formula. Mind Tan Body Skin Hydrating Glow Sleep Serum. Now I did use this yesterday. I used it last night because I got my boxes last night when I got home from the lake. And um, um, yeah, so I used it last night. And when I woke up this morning, my skin was like super soft, glowy, clear, like, whoo! I really liked it and it smells delicious. It smells super good. Um, so, this says, um, greet the day with, bleh, bleh, I can't talk. I can never talk. Every time I'm recording, I'm always like, bleh, bleh, bleh. So, um, greet the day with glowing skin, hydroglow sleep serum, and Instantly absorbs with a triple action hyaluronic acid formula, delivering time released multi depth hydrating for fully hydrated skin that glows. Wake up looking fabulous and greet the day with glowing skin. Very true, that's what happened today. Um, but it's like a little bottle, little bottle like this. This little bottle retails for $44.95. No. Elizabeth Elizabeth is it Mott? I think um so anyways these are this is the thank me later eye primer it is a cruelty free primer enhances your eyeshadow and protects your makeup all day apply in the morning and go all night long without worrying that's a big claim there buddy um, dries quickly and transparent prepping your eyelids for a smooth and even application um, of your shadow. So this retails for $20. It's very small. But um, let's go ahead and toss this on our eyes right now. If I can get it out. Oh, it's a little thick. It's a little thick there, buddy. Last thing in this box is <clears throat> Scratch my throat. The Butter London Teddy Boy Nine Piece Eyeshadow Palette. So it opens 
like this and you got a little plastic and then it says looking good looking good darling darling and then it has a little mirror right here um okay it's cute it is cute I feel like they're all super dark that I wouldn't necessarily reach for it except for Nigel here which is a um, nice base shade and Archie right here because it is like that nice pretty shimmer like a, a silvery shimmer shade but it's like super thin and like um, it's not like a high pigment like super high pigment um, it's kind of sheer but they're all named after guys we have uh, let me show you uh, Freddy Simon Mick Francis Billy Billy's kind of cute too I don't want to swatch them because I'm not sure if I was, ooh, Billy is nice. I love that one. Um, Nigel, like I said, that base color. Archie, that um, shimmer shade. And Graham is a deep chocolate brown. And Rupert is a matte black. Sorry. A matte black. Um, palette retails for $28. So, um, I do like to let you guys know what everything came out to, um, for the base box. Everything comes out to $147.95, and you're only paying $25. Come on. Get some really good things in here, guys. Um, let's go ahead and jump into the premium box. The big box. The big... Yo, bitch, gonna mean Big Daddy. Have you guys heard that song? That's just so funny. Um, I'm so excited. So excited for this one. Okay. So, same theme. And we have one, two, three, four, five, six products in this one. The last one had five. Oh, bitch, I'm so excited. Okay. Oh, here we go. The first thing is my choice item, and it is the Ulla Henriksen Banana Bright Face Primer. So it instantly illuminates, hydrates, and improves foundation wear all day with vitamin C. Let's see. Vitamin C powered illuminating makeup primer delivers instant radiance while improving and extending makeup wear. Inspired by the makeup artist must have banana powder. I use banana powder. I love banana powder. It works perfectly with my skin tone. Um, and like it brightens and looks really good. So, um, this subtly sunny makeup primer uh, contains brightening pigments to bring radiance to the entire complexion. This retails for $38. Guys, I am so excited to use this. The next thing in the box is the Ciate London New England Editor Palette. Guys, this shit is so cute. So, inspired by New England in fall, this palette features super soft and blendable shadows in a mix of richly pigmented um, autumnal hues. Mix and match the metallic glitters and mattes for effortless hazy eye looks oh bitch go to the box look at how cute this is they're like little leaf like big leaves right here I was gonna say little but they're big big leaves it's nice nice packaging hard packaging oh rich oh a huge mirror take that off huge mirror and look at that. Look beautiful.
Um, that palette retails for $32. The next thing we have in here is from Milk. This is the Long Wear Gel Eyeliner. Long Wear Gel Liner has a highly pigmented waterproof formula. We're going to be testing that shit out. Um, that stays in line all day long. Hydrating avocado oil and hyaluronic acid combines a smooth, combined, <laughs> combined to smooth the look of skin. So liner glides on without pulling or catching. The liner comes with a sharpener and a smudger, and allows for to allow for precise. I, I bit my tongue. Application or a smoky effect depending on your mood retails for $22 Next thing we have from Mac Mac cosmetics satin lipstick a creamy Lipstick formula with a soft cushiony feel medium to full buildable coverage and a satin finish this retails for $19 I have it in the shade mocha My kind of color Ooh, that is pretty. Super pretty. My rocking chair. Super pretty. It's like a pinky nude. It's like real pinky though. Guys, guess what? I have a damn blueberry or strawberry little seed in my tooth. That reminds me of. I was watching, um, so I, like, re-watch Kathleen Lights and Jesse Smile videos all the time, because they're so funny, and, like, they just never get old, and, like, if I don't have anything to watch on TV, I'll just put them on, and I laugh every single, every single time I watch those, their videos, even though I've seen them a million times. And I can, like, sit there and, like, I know what they're going to say next. Or It's, like, weird, but I love their videos. It's, yeah. So, one of her videos, um, she is talking and uh, Kathleen is talking and she's yelling to um, Jesse. And um, I talk about them like they're, you know, my best friends, you know? So, <laughs> Kathleen is yelling to um, Jesse in the bathroom and then she was like, she was like, oh my god, I have frijoles in my tooth and she had like a piece of piece of the beans in her tooth it was so funny but that's what that reminded me of right now fucking blueberry like it's nobody's business like so if you're like old and wrinkly like me oh my god what the heck i have a frijol in my tooth Well, at least it wasn't beans. The next thing we have in here is from Fenty Beauty. It is a portable contour, contour, contour or and concealer brush in 150. Um, just a brush. Okay, a magnetic retractable contour and concealer brush that retracts to that that attaches to your favorite matchstick matte skin stick for seamless sculpting and blending in a snap. I don't have any of the um, skin sticks, but it's okay. Anyways, the last thing in the box is something I'm really excited for. It is the Too Faced Born This Way Setting Powder. The setting powder pr provides a veil of perfecting luminosity for a finish, for a finish so natural, they'll think you were born this way. The formula is infused with hyaluronic acid, which gives a smoother, more youthful appearance. This retails for $33. And I got it in the shade Translucent. This box comes out to $168 when you're only paying $35. Come on, guys. That's like paying for just the powder or just the primer. You guys, are, you guys are missing out. I'm going to go into um, this shade right here. It is a um, skin tone shade. Right there. Morphe and Jaclyn Hill JH36. And just with a really light 
shade, um, this one right here, this light brown. I'm just going to go in like a dome chip around her eye that. Blend it out super easy. We're going to play, I think Rupert's like a dark gray though. Yeah, he's like a charcoal dark gray. But I mean, he looks kind of black, so I don't know. Should we do it? <laughs> do I have anything to wipe it off on? I was going to use my leg. We're going to use Billy from this palette, this shade, and this shade. I use the uh, brush we use that dark brown for and go over our edges here. And we are back. Okay, so this is the eyes. And I throw on some lot. I look super dark. Okay. Focus. Focus, bitch. Okay. I throw on some lashes. These are from Lashaholic Luxury Lashes. I absolutely love their lashes. They are really, really pretty and um, comfortable. We're going to hurry up and get into this face because it's taking forever. So, primer. Super excited. There we go. It's like a banana um, yellow tone. So I look very luminous. Very luminous right now. Uh, pretty fresh foundation in the shade uh, Medium ADW. This is the concealer in Warm Beige. I think it's going to be darker than the foundation. Oh. It's okay. To set our face, we are using the um, Too Faced uh, Born This Way Ethanol set, uh, Translucent Setting Powder. Get in here with my sponge just so I can get as close as I want right here around my eyes. Damn, you know, actually what I wanted to do was, damn, this looks good. Here we go. So I um, used the palette, but I went in with a little bit of the butter bronzer just because it was a little bit deeper and um, it's smoother to me. So... I really, really like this bronzer. Um, if you guys haven't tried it, I got this one at Ulta. They sell it at Walmart, Target, all, the, all those other places. Um, I got mine from Ulta in um, Deep Bronzer. I think this is the uh, darkest one. And um, it's like 12 months, 11 something, 12 months, I think. Um, but it's really good. Really, really, really good. So, um, I used... The uh, Hula Bronzer, I used this blush, and I used just a tiny bit of cookie here, 
um, as my highlight, um, but mainly the Amarese highlighter because that shit is amazing. Look at how beautiful that shit is. So I use that and I'm looking um, bronzed and blushy and I put some uh, bottom mascara on Let's throw some lips on so we can finish this. I'm going to use uh, Morphe Sweet Tea as always. Let's use the MAC one first. The uh, Clarence Paris one. This beautiful bitch right here. Alright guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you guys uh, did like this video, if you like this look, um, please let me know down below. Uh, don't forget to like this video, hit me up on Instagram, let me know anything that you guys would like to see um, next. If you guys like the way that the halo eye turned out, I know that I really, really do. Um, I can go ahead and uh, continue doing some more looks like this um, instead of my usual half cut crease because I know I do that all the time and this just seems like it's a little bit easier easier to do um, than having to like try to do a half cut crease but I really really love the way my makeup turned out today and you know what we're not even going anywhere I'm about to go cook and clean my house that's it and i gotta edit because i have like three videos that i haven't edited yet i'm horrible i know i know um but let me know how you guys um feel about this look about any of these products if you are interested in trying any of them or if you have tried any of them let me know and what you guys would like to see next because I'm kind of running out of ideas. I haven't got anything new in a while and I just used everything that I got that was new. So yeah, guys, that is going to be it. Shut up. That is going to be it for today's video. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed. If so, please um, leave me a comment down below. Like this video. Subscribe to my channel if you are not already. And you can share this video, you know, and I've got a lot of subscribers, guys. Um, <laughs> yeah, uh, I do post it on Facebook um, when I upload a video, so you can always share that post, um, share my page, whatever it is that, you know, you guys want to do. I'm just trying to expand and uh, get my videos out there a little bit more than what they are because there's not a lot of people that watch me and I wish there were but yeah that is going to be it for today's video hopefully you guys enjoyed uh, again like I said like a couple minutes ago um I will see you guys in my next one isn't it pretty mm. I'm so so happy so excited okay see you guys in the next one bye oh this palette smells so good oh, i love it is that weird oh well i don't care